Lucy Anderson, Labour MEP for London. How significant is it that half the money towards this project, the Northern Line extension, is coming from the European Union in the form of a loan? This is a very important project for London and it shows the importance also of EU funding in benefiting citizens both in transport funding and in other projects and we know that billions over the last few years have been allocated in this way across the UK and in terms of London this Northern Line extension is long overdue. It needs to be properly managed in terms of the businesses and shops that are going to be created and the impact on local residents but we know that the jobs will be created and that the local communities will benefit and for that matter we need further extensions to Clapham Junction to join up with Crossrail 2 which again we're not investing enough and the government needs to take notice of this we're not investing enough across the board in London's infrastructure. We're talking here about £480 million from Europe. To what extent does this money help to ensure that this project goes ahead? After all, I understand that the groundwork is, is kind of getting underway. We're expecting things to get moving within months. It's very important. I think it's about half the costs. So I think without this loan, it would certainly take longer to raise the funding. And it's very important for London as a whole. So it is very significant that this money is made available as it has been across Europe for key transport projects. And just explain for people that don't know about it the, how the European Investment Bank works because one of the, the, the kind of significant things about it is that the, the it, yes it is a loan but the repay, the interest rate is very very low com compared to commercial loans. That's presumably to the advantage of taxpayers in London. It makes a big difference and it's, it's, it's about fairness and it's about saying there are certain projects that we want to prioritise and therefore massive profits shouldn't be made uh, off the back of that and that's something that, which we in the Labour Party are very concerned about and also don't forget that the bank is essentially owned by member states so it is a joint enterprise and it's run in a different way from a commercial undertaking. We understand that uh, the loan repayments for the European Investment Bank will be made uh, according to the EIB by contributions from new developments in the area but also from business rates from the Nine Elms Enterprise Zone. Is that a system that, that you support? Does that make sense as a way of re uh, recouping the money that the EU is investing here? Well I think it's fair that those who benefit should pay a share. Certainly the Labour Party is in favour of doing all it can to help small businesses, so we wouldn't want businesses to be unduly burdened, but it's important that everyone pays a fair share.